Hey guys, it's Lindsay, and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to help you get rid of the message, please try again later, on Twitter. So let's get started. The first thing you're going to want to do is switch to LTE. So let's go to settings. The reason we switch to LTE is because sometimes cellular data works a lot faster than your weak Wi-Fi connection. So we're going to choose the second option, Wi-Fi and then I'm just gonna to toggle Wi-Fi off. Now, if this doesn't get rid of the message, we are going to have to offload the app. So let's go back to the main page in settings and then click on general and then go ahead and click on iPhone storage and then scroll down to where it says Twitter. Go ahead and click on Twitter and then click offload the app. Confirm it. The reason we do this is because it clears the cache in your app. All right, go ahead and reinstall the app. All right, and you have successfully offloaded the app. Now, if switching to LTE and offloading the app did not get rid of the message, I suggest that you go to Safari and search if Twitter is down. So I'm going to go to Safari and I'm just going to search our Twitter servers down question mark. And usually you can scroll down to a website services down that tells you if they're getting any reports of Twitter being down. So there are 33 reports of Twitter being down right now. And then it gives you a list at the bottom of everything that has problems currently. So YouTube, Uber, Amazon, Disney Plus, Twitter. If the problem doesn't go away, that's most likely because the Twitter servers are down. And there's really nothing you can do if Twitter is down. So... I hope this video helped you. If it did, please like and subscribe. If you have any questions about this tutorial, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.